In this video, we will cover how to update a record in Salesforce using a push update from Titan Web. In my Titan Builder, I've selected a blank project. Let's add a form and a few fields. Pick one column, five rows. And from here let's add three fields and a submit button so that we can update an existing account. We will call the first field account number. The second one we can call account name. And the third one account billing city. Before we continue, we will do a quick save. And now what I'm going to do is create a push to update the account name and account billing city on an account number entered by the user. So we'll come to our gear and go to Salesforce. This is the Salesforce integration window. We are going to create a push and I'll go ahead and click create new. From our object, we want to pick account. Give it a nice description. Update the account info based on account number. For our action, we want to pick update. In a case that we find multiple matches, we will choose the default. Picking the first record. You can also pick the last record or all, or bypass this process if more than one match is found. If no match is found, you can either skip the action or create a new record. In this case, we'll keep things simple and skip it. In our conditions, we want to find the record to update based on an entered account number. So let's find that field in Salesforce account number. We want the conditions to be our account number. Equals. And then our input field account number. Now we're going to go to mapping and we want to map the Salesforce account name field to our account name input field and billing city. We'll map that to our billing city field. We apply. We'll go ahead and close this and save it. And now we want to invoke that push update. And we will do that from this button click. So on the button, we want to go to the Actions menu. From here, we will add a node. We want to pick Salesforce Action. And we want to select the Push Update that we just created. We'll create an account for this. and we'll apply, and we'll go ahead and save. Now let's give this a test. In my connected Salesforce environment, I have a sample account called Monarch Restaurant Group. Its account number is 1234567. And the billing city is San Jose, California. Let's try updating this. So I'm gonna come into my preview. User inputs, I will find by account number 1234567. Let's change the name to Monarch Restaurants. And let's make the billing city San Francisco. If we go ahead and click our button, the push up update will run. Now let's see what happened. If I come into my Salesforce and refresh the data, I now see that the account name has changed to Monarch Restaurants. And the building city is San Francisco. You can also view this in Titan Builder. In the Salesforce integration window, select Integration Locks. As you can see, this one just ran. We updated this account.
And if we click on this link, it will take us to the updated record. And that is a push update in Titan Web.